All right, you guys, let's make some breakfast. Pete's Cafe Domingo. And of course, the old one is always left in there by all of us. I'm gonna be using these Market Basket plain bagels. I like Market Basket bagels. I honestly, oh, there's my dog. I can't always hide her, but um, don't worry, I won't feed her part of a bagel. And yes, I will go fuck yourself. All right, so I am going to put this in. I gotta show you my cool retro toaster. Now I got like, you know when the cream cheese is like bottom of the barrel, but you gotta use it because it's a waste to throw it away. So that's what we're working with here. All right, I ran out of that, so now I'm using the Philadelphia Whipped, which honestly um, is not our favorite, the whipped kind, uh, but it's Philadelphia and it's all they had. So it does spread easier. I personally feel that there is no taste like classic brick Philadelphia cream cheese, but that's just me. Literally, I just pour sugar in here from a, Do you know my husband the other day? Okay, I was literally mid shit. He busted in the bathroom, okay, and he took a handful of sugar and he poured it on my head and he was like, it's like that Def Leppard song. I... If you've never had sugar in your hair, which I hope you haven't because it's kind of odd, um, I had sugar in my, like, on my scalp because I don't really have hair, um, literally for, like, two days after. It wouldn't come out. It was like sand, like when you get sand in your ass crack. That's what it was like. We're having, uh, peppermint mocha coffee mate because my husband likes it, so it's just a sacrifice I'm making for marriage, okay? Sometimes you gotta do it, you know what I mean? And with mine, I'm also having a cold snapple apple because I cannot eat food with just hot coffee. I don't know how people do that. Have a good day. Let me tell you about uh, morning in my household this morning, okay? So I wake up um, to my son packing his bags, wanting to run away. Yeah, he, he needs a vacation. That's another thing. He needs a vacation. The first week of school was too much for him. He needs a vacation. He needs to get out of here, okay? So anyways, I wake up to my son packing his bag, saying he's going to run away. And why, you ask? Why? Because my husband would not allow him to intentionally flood the bathroom. <laughs> you see, that was my kid's last limit, okay? If he couldn't flood that effing bathroom, he was out of here. That's it. That's his final straw. So then I'm already up, right? Um, and then he says to me... What's lunch going to be when I'm 16 years old? And he fully expects me to know. So yeah, as I said, um, he needs a vacation. He says, um, you know, the first week of school, he's like, I need a vacation. I need to go somewhere. I need a vacation. So yeah, this is my second cup of coffee. I usually don't drink uh, more than one, but uh, I'm going to need it today. So hope you're having a good day. <laughs> All right, you guys, I wanted to show you what my husband made me for breakfast. So I made um, butter, herb, garlic, mashed potatoes last night. Not homemade, but um, he refried them. Look how good they look. I love the crispy um, edges. Is that what you'd say? I don't know. And then this is an Asiago cheese bagel. And look, you can't tell. I love burnt bagels. If you're new here, I love burnt bagels. Uh, so he was instructed to burn it. Uh, these ones, they're by, is it Infagel Bagel? I don't know. It's something like that. But they also have cheese on the bottom, which is very hard to find. And then I have a vanilla M&M play and hazelnut mocha coffee with peppermint mocha creamer, the Grinch kind. So I hope you're having a great morning. I'll see you later. All right, you guys, my dog ate my bagel. So I have to go out and get something for breakfast this morning. So I figured I'd take you along. So I got two medium iced coffees from McDonald's, 358. Um, that's my order, except I got decaf. Um, and then we went to Heavenly Donuts. This was expensive, 525, but they're great there. They really are. And this was, uh, we got two Asiago bagels with chive cream cheese, $6.90. Um, here, this is pretty cheap. I don't know about where you live. Um, so for all of it, it was $15.73. That was my dog, sorry. <laughs> Okay, I already filled it up. Okay, so we're making breakfast. I'm making breakfast and we're just gonna have um, These ham and cheddar croissant hot pockets, which I'm excited because I think they're gonna be better than the ones with like chunks of ham in it Not that they're terrible, but all right um, So yes, it's kind of late because um, on weekends I get to sleep in my son doesn't have school um, So I'm gonna make this and then my husband's making his coffee I'm gonna make myself some tea and then we'll pick out some yogurt. Okay, <laughs> my husband is putting Hold on. Let, put it in. Let me show him. He put a white chocolate um, Hershey thing in there because Roman messed with the sugar. 
the sugar in the jar, so he's afraid to use it. I don't blame him. Uh, so he's using that as his sugar. <laughs> All right, you guys, so these are my beautiful um, little canisters, Pioneer Woman ones that I keep. I actually think they're mason jars. Um, they're supposed to be straw cups that I keep um, the tea in. So this one is hibiscus. This one is decaffeinated green tea. That's my husband's. Uh, this is peppermint, but I think there's some Earl Grey, isn't there? Oh, no. This is the Earl Grey, right? I don't know, but I know I want Earl Grey or hibiscus, so I gotta decide. All right, you guys, I'm picking this uh, double double bergamot. I don't know. Um, Earl Grey. I know I like Earl Grey, so I'm gonna go with that. See this cup now? See it? See what it looks like? Now look at it. Look at that. How cool is that? Oh my god, it's on both sides too. All right, I'll let that be for a while. All right, cut the hot pockets in half. All right, and I guess I'll just use this uh, white mocha from Starbucks. Uh, no sugar, because my son got into it. Should I put a candy in it? I and for yogurts, um, my husband is having this total um, honey one. What do you put into it? Fruit or something? Honey, I think. Oh, there's actual honey. Okay. I think. I don't know. And this is my favorite, as you know, Chobani Salted Caramel Crunch Flips. Um, so, yeah. Hope you're having a good day. Good morning, you guys. My kid was up at 1 a.m. 1 a.m. Um, he didn't go back to bed till I think it was like seven ish and um i woke up and like my husband had fallen asleep on the couch he got up with him for most of the night you know what i mean and then uh, my son um i couldn't tell if he was sleeping because sometimes he sleeps with his eyes open i do it too and so does my dad that makes us even more like the adams family but um i look at he he fell asleep and then we had to leave a half hour late and go to school so it's gonna be an interesting day for him and uh we're just gonna try to we have a lot to do today so no sleeping all right so um i got asiago bagels this morning because i ran obviously i didn't have bagels remember my dog ate mine um and i needed cream cheese but i'm so tired i'm not even gonna fuck with bagels um i'll eat them tomorrow not all of them you know what i mean so um look at these pumpkin muffins five bucks for all these muffins they're fucking gigantic let me show you you know, fun fact, um, my best friend and I, we've been best friends since I was, like, probably nine-ish, I think. So, like, um, not quite, but, like, almost 30 years, like, 25, 26 years or something. Um, but look at these muffins. Oh, beautiful. They look good. They smell gorgeous, too. Um, and we used to always go to Shaw's Bakery and um, sit in the parking lot and, like, devour... Um, food from there because it was so good uh, i think their bakery is still good it's gone downhill a little bit um it used to be in its prime when we would like mouth face in the car um but all right now i gotta make some coffee to go with it i'm gonna go with these cinnamon vanilla ones just great value they were only like four dollars for a whole box of these um but i think it would taste good like the cinnamon vanilla with the pumpkin muffin so that's what i'm gonna do All right, you guys, so as you see, I have my chicken cup, and my husband has uh, his Yoda cup. Grogu, sorry, I don't know much about Star Wars. Um, now, I've been mixing this coconut cream by Coffee Mate and uh, white chocolate mocha from Starbucks together, because as I said, my son messed with the sugar. I don't know what he did. I'm not using it. And then I'm having my salted caramel Chobani, and he's having Okios peach, so hope you're having a good morning. All right, you guys, good morning. I'm making my husband and I some breakfast. Um, and listen, I've learned to keep my bagels in the refrigerator now. I know a lot of people suggest it. I personally, I just don't like it. I don't know why I don't like it. Um, but my dog keeps eating them, so uh, I'm sick of dishing out money. So, of course, I got the Finagle Bagel, my favorite brand now. Um, so, yeah. Do you hear that? That's the sound of a Newfoundland drinking. Loud as shit. As for a coffee flavor, we're gonna go with Great Value Cinnamon Vanilla. It was cheap, so I bought it, and it's still kind of like fall-like, I feel, or autumn-like. You know what I mean? So, uh, 
That's what we're gonna use. So you guys, I, oh, by the way, my husband and I will share this bagel. I'm getting the bottom half with the cheese, but then he's getting the top half with this cheese. You know what I mean? It's a win-win situation. He actually likes it lightly toasted, but too bad this morning. <laughs> um, so anyways, I was proud of myself because, um, why isn't this spreading? I don't like the spreadable kind. Anyways, block cream cheese only, Philadelphia. Okay, so um, I was proud of myself because I was going to go to Dunkin' Donuts because I had to, or my husband and I had to run a couple errands. Um, but I, I kind of like our routine of eating breakfast together at home now because we watch Supernatural. I chill out and I just think it's a good routine. It's a good routine to be in. So I was proud of myself that I didn't spend money on, uh, you know, fast food. And instead I just waited till we got home. <laughs> All right, today I'm using my chicken mug, and he's using his uh, Grogu mug, right? Grogu Baby Yoda. I don't know. I got some Cold Stone Creamery Creamer. I like it because I don't think I'll need sugar. And then I'm having this strawberry uh, cheesecake crunch yogurt and overnight oats for my husband. Good morning, you guys. I just woke up. It's freezing out. Came out of nowhere. Okay, but my husband made me breakfast. It looks so good. So um, the other day I ate egg and I didn't get sick or anything. So I'm eating it again. So it's a farm fresh egg fried on an Asiago cheese bagel with cheese on it. And then we got some Canadian bacon and then some homemade home fries um, with onion. And... I think there's cheese on them or something. Oh my god, it looks so good. And coffee too, so I hope you're having a good morning. All right, you guys, this is earlier today. I got a peach freeze from Heavenly Donuts, and it was pretty good. I didn't realize my seatbelt was twisted. We are going to Home Depot for some topsoil to fill a crater that my ducks made. Um, so we decided on this brand, and that's what we got. Look at my husband, so handsome. And we also needed some toilet bowl cleaner, so there's that. Hope you had a good day. All right, you guys, I haven't made a fancy breakfast in so long, and that's what I'm going to do, so I'm really excited. Um, first, I'm going to start by uh, cutting up the potatoes but it's always a struggle for me so I'm not doing that on camera I'll be right back all right you guys I got the potatoes cut up and now I'm putting in some frozen uh, onion I'm gonna put in some adobo some salt black pepper minced garlic and I'm gonna put some olive oil in all right the home fries are cooking and now I'm gonna get started on these Panera bagels that my Leah delivered to our house Asiago cheese and now I'm going to be cooking up these uh, breakfast ham slices but really it's Canadian bacon. All right, you guys, I cream cheese the bagel. I should have said it a different way. Some of our farm fresh eggs, which I'm surprised this hasn't cooled down more, but we're just gonna go for it. Well, it formed like a caramelized, oh, well that's burnt. I have to do it over, that was even too burnt for me. Put some Godzilla hot sauce on it, so, oops. There's breakfast. All right, you guys, this was my morning. I got this iced coffee for free at Dunkin's. It was like National Iced Coffee Day. It's Hazelnut 5 and 5 again. And uh, I got some sliced Asiago cheese bagels from Panera. Again, some fresh ones like my Leah got us. Oh, my God, I love them. My husband made me a breakfast sandwich out of them. It was so good. Now I'm lighting my favorite candle, sweet cinnamon pumpkin. It smells like a cottage when you walk in the house. I love it. And then I got to work. But my laptop lid is always so dirty because I always wear lotion. It gets smudge good morning you guys um it is a cold day in new england um i keep saying it but i feel like the weather got like really cold really quick i mean it's new hampshire we're used to having really cold weather but i mean it just changed so fast um i actually had to put my husband's sweatpants in the dryer before i put them on because i was so freezing um but i'm gonna make some blueberry bagels we're each gonna have a half with some cream cheese philadelphia of course so let's get started i present to you my retro toaster, how cute is that? Whoops, I didn't even plug it in. So yesterday I had the genius idea to clean our front door with a magic eraser. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, I don't know. Sometimes I just do and I don't think, okay? So uh, now I gotta find a way to uh, get all the residue off because my front door literally looks like it has like chalk all over it. Um, Halloween. Actually, yeah, but... It looks like a spirit rubbed against the door. It does look like that, yes. He's the new coffee maker. Here we go. What are we going to use? Oh, the only coffee we have, but it's still wonderful. Creamy hazelnut. 
All right, you guys, I don't got a lot of cream cheese left, um, but I'm just gonna, oops, there goes part of <laughs> I'm just gonna use what I have, which I honestly don't always like a whole lot. I don't want dried cream cheese on it. I honestly don't always like uh, a lot of cream cheese. By the way, if you think these are burnt, they are. I like them burnt. I didn't mean to burn both of them because my husband doesn't like them burnt, um, but what are you gonna do? Oh my god, I put way too much coffee in that cup. Hey, that's not a bad amount left. Sugar. All right, now I'm trying this creamer for the first time. It is Starbucks non-dairy creamer, almond and oat milk, hazelnut latte. I think it'll taste good um, with the hazelnut. I've never used one of these tops before. I kind of don't like them. Do, 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 do. So my husband and I will split the bagel and on the side he's having this like Nilla wafer cup thing and I'm gonna have this SO delicious pairing salted caramel cluster. Um, I will let you know in the comments what I think of that in the creamer since I haven't had either of them before and I hope you're having a good morning. All right you guys this is from breakfast today so here we go. Do 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 do. All right. All right so I got some bacon here so first I'm just gonna put that in the pan. It's already heated. There we go pulling apart the bacon. Bacon. Oh, yeah. There's only three pieces. Um, I'm going to give my kid one and then one each for my husband and I. I don't need a lot of bacon to be happy. Um, I mean, money is good, but that's just like bacon, bacon. All right. Some uh, tater tots. Um, oh, I want to do that. Um, you know, that trick that I learned from TikTok. I keep doing it. It's great. Uh, my husband taught me how to make like hash brown type things. I don't know what you'd call them. Oh, I forgot the oil. That's fine. Uh, but out of tater tots and they come out so good, honestly. I, I feel like they're better than the ones you get that are actually for hash browns. So I put the oil in and I'm going to wait for them to heat up before I put any spices in or seasonings, whatever. Look at, see, ties right up. Okay, some adobo. It's melted. It's not melted. What is that? Thought a little bit. Whoops, a little bit too much garlic powder. Some black pepper. Do, do, do. Ba, 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 ba. Ba, 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 ba. Some salt, and you gotta throw it over your left shoulder, just in case. All right, some chopped onions. I had it upside down. It's a little frozen. That's fine. It's all right. The bacon's done. I like it kind of burnt, so that's why you're seeing what you're seeing. Um, then we're using this Helpful Hens Egg brand. I'm glad their hens are helpful. Uh, mine provide nothing but friendship at this point, um, but that's fine. So I'm putting those in the bacon grease. Oh, yeah. Getting the yolk all over it, all over it. But see, um, I have to in a... Oh, wait. First, I'm going to show you this first. Okay, so that's what it looks like. I only had this pizza cheese left over. It was mozzarella and parmesan. I thought it was going to be gross, but it was actually pretty good. Um, so I put that on. I was so afraid it would taste like a pizza. Okay, so this is what I was going to say. I have to cook my sons in a separate clean pan because he wouldn't like his eggs with bacon grease. This is what it looks like. Like I said, very little bacon, but that's fine. I'm fine with it. I hope you had a great morning early. All right, you guys, good morning. My husband made me breakfast, so I just wanted to show you hash browns. Or it's really crushed up tater tots with um, onion and some uh, cheese melted on top. And then an egg. I don't like a lot of eggs. This is hazelnut mocha coffee by Pete's Cafe or whatever. And then uh, it's, uh, I think, white mocha Starbucks. I'm excited. He gave me his, what is this? Fortnite or something? What is this? Halo. <laughs> oh, Halo. I don't know. All right, you guys, good morning. Um, I like this hat on me because I feel like I really look like the pigeon lady from Home Alone. And it's, if you don't know me, I love birds. I have like 25 of them, so it really fits my aesthetic and my uh, core personality trait. Um, so yes, I'm making these. I think my husband's coming in with the dog soon. Um, he's outside taking care of the birds outside. Uh, cinnamon raisin bagels. Oh my God. He's chasing the dog. Uh, okay, so cinnamon raisin bagels I got. I don't even know if my husband likes them, but he's gonna like them just for this morning, you know what I mean? And I also made us coffee, the Pete's Pumpkin Spice. And you wanna know something? I have a question. This has been, like, this has been uh, ringing on my mind all morning. Okay, last night I was watching TV, and um, this woman, she... I don't want this one. Okay, this woman, um, she... <laughs> called she said the word she was trying to call someone like genuine and she said genuine and then i'm like oh my god have i been saying that because i say that word a lot because i think i'm a very genuine person and i'm thinking have i been saying that word 
wrong all my life. I thought Genuine was the rapper. <laughs> yeah, this one has a thicker bottom. Ooh. <laughs> so, I have a Rick Sanchez ass. So that's going in. I forgot to plug it in. <laughs> Did you miss me? <laughs> you dogs can't have raisins, I don't think. They can't have, I think, uh, cinnamon, anything cinnamon spice. Yeah. I'm sorry, and you can't have the coffee either. It's pumpkin spice. That means it has nutmeg. Not that she drinks coffee. She doesn't need it, trust me. All right, so we got this uh, Chobani French Vanilla Creamer. I had it once so far. Um, it's all right. It's not my favorite. Um, Chobani, great in yogurt. Uh, not so great in the coffee game, in my opinion. Uh, they're cold brew or whatever. I did try, and I just... I don't know. It wasn't for me. Will you eat half of a cinnamon raisin bagel? Yuck, no. <laughs> you won't? No. I love okay, it. Okay, fine. Yeah. More bagel for me. So last time I showed you guys my butter hack, um, like half of you were mortified and some of you were like, um, oh my god, that's genius. All right, so this is what I do. Like, because when you, listen, let me explain it after I open it. Hi, Rosie. Okay. Now. If I were to just cut like this, a big chunk of butter, you know, I would have to spray. It doesn't matter how hot the bagel is. It's like, you know, some of it gets stuck. It gets ripped. The bagel gets ripped. You know what I mean? So this is what I do. And my husband gets so mad. It's criminal. I just, whoop, it's like a little ribbon. Look at that. Look at that. It is all the way, yeah, you can see it glistening. It just, some of it hasn't melted yet. But I think it's genius in my opinion. All right, you guys, for my husband, I'm making the Noosa yogurt thing again. You know, I have a couple other videos on it. They're hard to open. All right. Oh, I need a uh, spoon. I think this package is just beautiful every time I see it. Um, he can eat the bigger berries because his teeth don't bother him. Literally, he never has teeth problems. I just, I don't understand. Okay. Um, so there's that. I, you can just use the spoon, right? Okay. And then, I'm using this protein granola by uh, Quaker. It's the oats, chocolate, and almonds. Alright, and then some honey on top. See, this is so good, but I'm so sick of it because we've eaten it, like, every freaking day. I'm over it already. So, I get sick of food fast. Not food in general, but certain foods. We definitely need more honey. I think there's another partial jug of it for another day. Okay. All right. I hope you're all having a good morning. All right, you guys. So you guys gave me like uh, two ways to get the apple ice. Wait, no, iced apple crisp macchiato oat milk, whatever from Starbucks. You said first you need a straw to mix it up, and two, do it upside down. I did say upside down. Clearly, they did not do that. Um, but so doo -doo. it is better. It's still a little strong for me. I don't know. But it is better than it was before. So I think that's good advice. I do wonder what it would have tasted like if it was all at the top like it was supposed to be. But that's fine. The thing about Starbucks, okay, like if if anywhere else gets your order wrong, it's like whatever. Like it's it's like, you know, cheap food. You can't expect a lot from fast food. But Starbucks, you pay so much fucking money and tip. So like when you pay, what, $16 for two coffees and they don't come out right, it just kills you inside. That's my beef with Starbucks. But I hope you're having a good day. All right, you guys, good morning. To be honest, I'm not in the best mood. I know I'm usually very positive, but I'm very frustrated this morning. For one, I have no glasses, so I have to make iced coffee and these things, so I'm not happy about it. Then I got therapy, and usually I like therapy, but do I like therapy when I have 9 million things to do? No, I do not. So, oh, it's just too much. Too much to do today. Too much to do. Okay, I have to stay positive. I have a roof over my head. Life is okay. I got a good family. I'm just pissed off. <laughs> okay. Oh, ice. You need ice in these. My ice maker's not on. I'm trying to think of good things. It's almost Halloween. It's almost Christmas, more importantly. Um, that's exciting. What else? 
positives. Think of things that can cheer you up. Um, I did make a good dinner last night. That is true. Thank you. Hey, the sweet potato pie wasn't bad. That's positive. Look at the bright side. I got Starbucks coffee. I haven't had that in a while. I've had it from Starbucks, but not, um, you know, that home one. So, that's a good thing. Oh, one thing cute. My son, uh, yesterday, he woke me up, um, and kissed, he woke me up. He was, like, dying to wake me up, right? Um, he kept, like, telling my husband he wanted to wake me up. And then he woke me up, and he just kissed me on the cheek. Isn't that sweet? That's sweet. That's something to be positive about. Oh, positive. I found the sugar. I was gonna be so mad if I couldn't find it, but I found it. Alright. Alright, I got a cinnamon raisin bagel, and of course I burnt it. I like my bagels burnt. I'm another positive. It's fucking burnt, and I like burnt bagels, so it's gonna taste good. And I can sit and watch Supernatural and have a good morning before... I already started, though. I already started getting my to-do list done, because it was just, it's really over. There's just too much today. It's just one of those things. There's too much, and I gotta remind myself, you can't do all of it in one day. There's just no way. So you just do your best, and that's all you can do. Okay, I need to get, um, cream cheese. Philadelphia always. Wait, do you want some cream cheese? Cereal? Yeah. Okay. Our son eats that Reese cereal for breakfast now. Which is pretty cool that he's eating cereal, because not with milk, but hey, he's eating cereal. So yeah, I hope you're all having a good morning. I'll be back in a better mood. I just gotta regulate. Da, 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 da. Alright, you guys, so we didn't have anything for breakfast. I ran out of bagels. My husband ran out of yogurt. Um, so I did stop at Dunkin' Donuts because there was no way in hell I was going to a grocery store first thing in the morning. Listen, I know we go, like, every single day. We get, like, a little here and there, you know, depending on how much we have. But, um, absolutely not. I cannot handle it in the morning. Actually, I hate grocery stores. Fun fact. Um, I literally, I have a lot of anxiety grocery shopping. But doing the videos is something that really helps me with it. But anyways, so I, uh... Went to Dunkin' Donuts. This was my first time ordering. No, second time ordering from the app. But, like, actually, I think this was my first time ordering and paying on the app. I don't know. But I got two orders of hash browns for my husband and I. I love Dunkin' hash browns. They're consistently good, you know what I mean? Once in a while, they might be burnt, but not too often. And then, um, got these everything bagel stuffed mini bites, which I think is a little expensive. For two of them, it's like $2.59, um, but I mean, what are you going to do? I'm the one who bought them, so what can I say? Um, yeah, I still agree on the rewards program, terrible, but I like the people that work there, and it's convenient, so I'm not, I'm going to keep going back, but I got to make us coffee, so here we go. My ice maker isn't on yet, so we're going to use some regular ice. Do, 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 do. You can hear my ducks. I don't know if you heard that, but that's my ducks. Do, 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 do. Light some sugar. I forgot to show me putting that into the coffee yesterday. Do, 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 do. Some people will be like, why do you use plastic? Um, I use whatever the heck is around me that I have access to. And sometimes, like, I'll have an instinct, like, I should go get a metal spoon just so on camera, like, you guys see me using metal cutlery and you don't, um, have a fit about it. But I'm not gonna act a certain way in my videos that I don't act in real life. And the reality is sometimes if I got a plastic spoon nearby, I'm gonna fucking use it. And that's just life. That's just how life is. Don't know what to tell ya. Alright, so we got the Starbucks coffee. And like I said, the only thing I don't like about this, it goes so fast. And I feel like it is expensive. It's not as expensive as getting, like, Dunkin' and stuff like that. But, you know, but it's really the only one I like. I don't really like the Dunkin' one, like the cold brew one as much. Yeah, it wouldn't be cold brew, it's just iced coffee. Um, and also, oh, I like the stock one, but that's just as much money, I think. So, it's like, what's the point, you know what I mean? I got this Cold Stone uh, Creamery, right? Yeah, sweet cream, creamer. I've been to Cold Stone, I think. Hi, Rosie. Are you making a debut? Of course. No, I'm sorry. You're right. I didn't get her a donut. Oh, my God. How could I? I'm so sorry. I really forgot. For real. 
Okay. I'll get you one later. Nope, she's pissed. <laughs> oh my god, they're so pretty. It's like ombre. I love it. Do, do Halloween's almost soon. Still haven't figured out uh, what we're gonna do with our kid. I really kind of just wanted to get like candy and hide around the house because he, um, they have like a parade at school and like I think they, oh, somebody said take him to the mall. And I think that's a good idea. Except I was telling people in my live uh, one year, um, there was this like Halloween costume day at the mall near me. And so my kid and I, I dressed up as Batwoman. This is pre transition. I mean, full like leather gear right okay i looked like like an assassin and then my kid um he was my batmobile <laughs> and we walked around like that we show up at the mall this it's packed tons of people nobody's dressed up just us nobody's dressed up so it was like half embarrassing but also half badass because we were like you know, confidently walking around as Batwoman in the Batmobile, and like nobody, so nobody knew what to think. So it was like, yeah, I'm in Macy's dress like this, yeah, yeah. But um, so yeah, I hope it's not like that again this year if we go and you know go to the store trick or treating. Unless it already passed, I don't think it did though. Um, but I hope we're like not the only ones dressed up, especially since my husband and I are dressing as sardines, per request of the kid. Uh, so yeah, hope you're having a good morning. All right, you guys, uh, good morning. I just wanted to show you what my husband made me for brunch. So we have an Asiago cheese um, by Finagle Bagel, bagel toasted with uh, Philadelphia cream cheese, some bacon, and then I have my, um, <laughs> um, I think it's Market Basket Dark Roast Cold Stone Creamery Creamer and Sugar Iced Coffee. And then I got the Bath and Body Works um, Pumpkin Spice, or pumpkin cinnamon candle going thanks to miley i love candles now now i'm like a candle person so i hope you're all having a great uh afternoon really it is and i will see you later all right you guys happy halloween um we just uh sent my kid off to school we'll drop him off and uh he's in his link costume so that's awesome uh he's super excited about it we saw a minion a witch um, some Dalmatians, um, Sonic the Hedgehog, which he was really excited about. Um, what else did we see? Um, Celtic Celtics, he means Celtics. <laughs> thing 1 and Thing 2, I think they were Celtics, uh, like Thing 1s and Thing 2. Or I don't really know, but it was cool. They had green hair. Um, yeah, lots of costumes. It was really cool. Um, so I got a bagel with cream cheese. My husband made me. It's Asiago cheese. I love my bagels burnt, you know, probably already. Um, the cream cheese keeps melting on it, so I don't know, but it's still, I'll eat it. I don't like a lot of cream cheese anyways. Um, and then some bacon. And then this is actually iced coffee, but it's um, the dark roast from Market Basket again with, uh, is it the C Cold Stone Creamery? Creamer. Yeah. And um, it's almost time for the Grinch Creamer. And then um, sugar, and so yeah, we're gonna watch Supernatural, and then I might bake a cake or sleep. I'm not sure which one yet. Hope you're having a good day.